Hello, my name is Chuck Orlandi with Miami Shores Auto Repair here in Miami Shores, Florida. Okay, in this clip we're going to talk about how to check a radiator, the water level in your radiator, the antifreeze level, whatever you want to call it. Okay, this is a Dodge pickup truck. This one has an external tank. Some cars have a cap right on top of the radiator and a lot of them have an external tank nowadays. What you want to make sure of here is that the, the car is not hot. When they're hot, they build up a lot of pressure in the hoses, and you, you can always tell when you squeeze them, make sure that there's no pressure before you take the cap off. It's dangerous. So when people come in here and the, and the car's hot, I make sure that I let it cool off first. What you do here, it's a two-part process. You turn it, it'll stop. You push it down, turn it again, and remove it. Look inside. We've got no problem here. It's, it's almost to the top. Uh, it's green, which means it's got antifreeze in it. You can also test it with, there's a, a, a item that you can test the level of the antifreeze to make sure there's enough of the freeze point. But here in Florida, we don't really worry about that too much. But up north, if you're in freezing temperatures, you're going to have to you know, check that to make sure you've got enough antifreeze in there. Uh, again, the importance for checking this is one of the more serious problems you can have with a car engine is overheating it and you don't want that to happen. That can cause you know, major, major expense, major issues. So again, this has been Chuck Orlandi at Miami Shores Auto Repair.